Hello and welcome to Optics Trade YouTube channel. We are at EVA 2025 and currently we're visiting Guide Booth and uh, we're just taking a look at their new thermal clip-ons. Andreas, the expert from Guide, <laughs> he'll tell us more about their new 650 model yeah. and the uh, refreshed or new version of the 630 yeah. for the LRF. Yes. Andreas. Let's start you. with the TV630 LRF. Uh, Germany, we waited quite long for this new model because we had some issues uh, by law, but now it's fixed and uh, we have the new version into the market. Honestly, um, the uh, hardware inside is mostly the same as in the TV630, we already know. Uh, it has a 35 millimeter lens and a 650 by uh, 512 pixel sensor. Um, wide field of view with uh, 22 meters, but what's uh, very special, you have an LCD screen with 1980 by 2 uh, by 1080 pixels, yeah. that means you've got 2 million pixels on the screen. That allows you to high up your magnification up to 6, 8, 10 yeah. without losing that much resolution. Uh, that makes it uh, very common for every kind of uh, hunting. If you need a wide field of view, you get it. If you want to uh, magnify, if you want to zoom up, then you can do it because the, re re the resolution uh, will be held by the device. So it's a Switzerland knife, I think. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> uh, very, very good device. Uh, yeah, the thread adapter stays the same, the classic M33.5, uh, as usual with guide. Yes, yeah. yes. Yeah. Um, in the difference between the old TB630 is here is only one uh, battery inside. This is the AT650 and they uh, built in the laser range finder in the left battery compartment. So it allows an operational time between five and six hours. What is the difference in pricing in regards to this model and the model without the LRF? So this is uh, for 1099. Mm -hmm close to 2000 and without laser range finder we have 1699 so 300 euro for the laser range finder so the product was already re released on the market or can we expect it soon uh, it's released on the market and the retailers will get it in a very short period of time okay then we can go on to the 650 so these are both the 650 yes this is the older generation yes and this is the new one Yes. Yeah, the difference is obvious. This yeah. device is, from my point of view, a little bit too big. Um, the, the laser rangefinder uh, was built up in a separate compartment on the top of the device. The advantage of this kind of product design is that the batteries, the two batteries, can build in um, vertically. Yeah. So, uh, against the shooting direction, um, but in the end the design is too big. The concept, the idea is good, but in the end the design is too, too big. Yeah. Um, guide changed the body now, they skipped one battery, so you have uh, just one 86 battery instead of two, but it's enough for a five five hour operating. So as a, okay. do you think the, the operating time on this one is uh, about the same as on the old model? No, no, no. because here you were able to uh, operate it for at least 10 hours yeah, yeah. and now it's the hard because yeah, you so, have only so one the, minute. the additional battery yeah. does yeah. make the difference. Right? What's interesting, uh, we have also the laser rangefinder inside the lens and uh, we have a bigger central uh, focus wheel instead of small focus wheel left and on the right side. Yeah. So uh, overall you have the same very high uh, picture quality as in the old TV650 in a very more common uh, 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 
yeah, black, yeah. nice suit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I mean, considering these are these are exactly this is the, the older generation, this yeah. is the newer generation. Yeah. Considering all the uh, all the different physical features, this really makes it for a much more, for, at least for me, a fresh design nicer device, I think. Definitely. I think the real trick is in the LRF because the LRF was moved inside the lens, which looks very nice, very smooth, very compact, uh, adds to the to the physicals of the, of the yeah. device. Yeah. What about the pricing? Uh, I don't know exactly, but I think we will be below one, uh, 2,500. Okay. Uh, what about the warranty? Three years. Three years? Three yeah. years. Yeah. Okay. I think we covered most of it. Yes. Andreas, thank you. You're welcome. If you enjoyed the video, please like it or press subscribe. Thank you and bye.